Doros Power of Life for Women. Today, Elizabeth wrote me very important question about how to save energy. And I have like 50 different emails from you guys. And I decide to today the topic dedicate about how to save energy and uh, how to don't lose energy so much. What is draining your energy? She write me, it's not easy. Life throw and your feet in various forms from the very unhappy boss to sleepless night. First, you need to determine what exactly is your problem. You see in the picture the woman who has laptop, phone, calculator, and we women doing many things in the one time. The brain woman work like this. We have possibility open computer, thinking we write something in the office, we thinking what we make from the lunch, and when we come back home, we just planning when we go buy shoes for children. Next, we decide what we cook for the dinner. Is not true? Yes, it's true, because the woman brain work work so faster. Woman brain. It's made to doing the plan and action and many things, many things. It's many neurons in the same time. Men dedicate his job and doing one job finish and go to another. If you understand this different, you always develop the happy relationship. But we come back to the topic about energy. We can divide energy into physical, mental and emotional. What exactly is the energy we have between us? Between is life. Energy is life. You see in the picture the beautiful, happy, organized woman with very nice energy. And I wish you all of you to learn something and organize your life to be happy and always have the pure energy inside you. In a broad sense, physical and emotional. Its optimal level gives a sense of well-being. When you understand that only you have the right to control and use your energy, you will stop stressing yourself. Don't let eternal factors affect your energy levels and your state of mind. Learn how to get into a new day with good, positive energy, which will help you stay in a good mood and stay motivated throughout the day. Once you learn how to plan your day, you will stop stressing yourself. Learn to forgive. And this has a direct impact on your level of health and the vital energy you carry within you. Understanding sleep and rest is also important and need to be included in your calendar. You plan the time when you work, plan time when you go to the gym and when you spend time with your family, but always you plan time for your sleep. If you sleep properly, you always have better pure energy. This is important. Sleep every day, seven to eight hours. Accept life as you are and enjoy the place where you are. And if you don't tolerate something, just change it. Sometimes we have no influence on the things that happen and you have to accept too. 
Organize your life to have positive energy, step by step. In the picture, you see the organized life in your desk room, where, where you work, where you spend more time, when you organize your paperwork, when you have pure energy in the room, your life definitely change. What's this mean? Then you plan clean your house. Every maybe one week you clean the kitchen. Next week you clean your laundry room. Every week something and something and just you finish after maybe two, three months. And you have pure energy. Everything what you give up from your house to the garbage or you give somebody many stuffs, you invite the pure energy to your house. You just imagine how many products we have in home which we never use. How many dresses in the woman cabinet. Me too. And anytime, it's one time per month, I just open cabinet and I clean everything. If you don't read many books because you don't have time, you know how many people love to reading and you have many library in the school. Please decide to give the present for your friends, family and others and to seniors living maybe and give plenty of books to the people. You have much more space in your house and you have much more energy. Clean your house, desk, place where you live and you develop the pure, pure energy. Learn to be assertive and distance from all those who use your kind heart to save their situation. And second, very important, learn to forgive. When somebody stress you and you are feel nervous, you always touch your heart. You're always doing something, exercise, and just tell, I forgive you and God bless you. This is the very important exercise when all forgiveness go up from your heart, from your soul, and you stay like pure woman, pure man. Sing out loud. Do you know when you wake up in the morning and you don't have energy, what is the amazing exercise every day, what I propose to the people? Just go to the shower, uh, especially cold shower give you more energy, the cold water, plus you're singing your beautiful song. And trust me, this makes your day happy and you feel like energy come to you. You feel like you are 30, 40 years younger. And next point, where you see the woman in the picture, how she's happy. Probably she make more money, but the happiness is not just money. The happiness is the something which we have inside the heart inside the brain and you decide believe me nobody for you have possibility make you happy only you and if you make happiness inside yourself you have possibility develop the happy family the happy workplace the happy world the happiness inside you everybody feel and people want spend more time with you you can only think of one emotion. Stop loving the negative emotions that are inside you. Sometimes we celebrate the negative emotion. Make them positive. And the next question from Elizabeth, write me how to make the positive. Instead of saying, I can do it, I can and any situation because I trust myself. Every morning you repeat the magic words. I trust myself. I win. Today is the best day for me.
do you know the simple exercise change your life you see in the picture the positive woman who like fly in the grass it's possible <laughs> but don't don't trouble your legs please but your happiness you develop point by point step by step every day this is the big job yes of course nothing which is good and important in life it's easy and is for free this is just your job and next point the anger learn to forgive and this has a direct impact on your level of health and the vital energy you carry within you the forgiveness it's everything negative emotion check why do you feel this way do not judge because it's only affect you you don't judge yourself then you have trouble life when you are child because this is not your choice then you live here in this place you just start to thinking positive and develop your pure energy positive energy and write the one page where are you and next page how you want to change this place how you want maybe start new job maybe doing better education maybe change the life where you are how you doing this why and when and when you give the answers very simple you have you have answer and and you have the path to the happiness and you decide to open better life and next very important point, don't surround yourself with toxic people who only need you to complain, share problems, tragic stories, fear, and judge others in your presence. Do you know how many people just wait to share the negative story with you? Maybe you have somebody close to your life. Just write who is this person and why stay with you to close and maybe you decide just for one month close relationship and you just watch how you feel better and this space when you give the time you feel like filter in the car when somebody call you every time and don't ask you how are you just tell you this my life is bad this don't happen you are happy I am never happy stop this relationship and uh, just decide do you want to come back to this relationship maybe you just need to explain the person why you feel bad and change her or his life to thinking much more positive but this is your decision realize that sleep and rest are also important and need to be included in your calendar
back to the show. Welcome, everybody. The power of life for women. Do you know today we're talking how to don't lose your energy and how to save energy. And next part of this beautiful meeting and the show will be about the little bit exercise, mental exercise for you. Take a cup of water and uh, take a pen and notebook and work with me. This is your free, very important first lesson. I give you two minutes or one minute. You just decide to write every question and after maybe this show, you just sit in the quiet place, make a cup of coffee or water and uh, you just work with the question, give the answer, and uh, just think how beautiful is your life and how you have possibility to change your life. Everybody ready? People in studio is ready? Yes, everybody ready. One minute more. Water, pen, notebook. And we start is the first question what is breaking down your energy professional work monotony of life lack of good relation and exchanges between partners lack of passion poor nutrition maybe bad relationship with friends or maybe negative attitude to live write it down in your notebook do it very carefully second very important point think now what have you spent too little time on in your life maybe you run out of time for physical activity or maybe for spiritual and intellectual development, write everything down on piece of paper in your notebook. Consider without any excuses and very honesty, why haven't you become more involved in these things? You be honest with yourself. You never lie because you don't like me. If you wrote different answer, which is not true, you just lie yourself. And please, now, be honest with yourself. And uh, question number three. Now write to something. Did you spend too much time, maybe to help other people who did not need it at all, maybe to do things that you didn't want to do, but didn't know how to talk about it. Maybe to fulfill not your desires, but those imposed by the environment. Write everything down in a piece of paper and think again why you do this. And you see here, maybe you don't have too much time because you needed digital detox. You know what is digital detox? We spend too much time, use the computer, cell phone, watch TV, be lazy, we don't read books, we don't learn, we don't try to doing more education background. We just so lazy to be in the sofa and just open the iPhone, be in the Facebook, maybe you take the time from your family. It's better than you take your family, go outside, play with children or plunge game, or you're doing something in your house together with your lovely husband and you just cook together, or you planning new garden, doing. Just be in action and doing something. Don't lose your time, because if you lose time to spend more times, many hours a day, 
in TV channel or cell phone in Facebook or social media, you lose your energy. The energy is like accumulator. If you exercise more, if you give more energy to your body, you take more energy from the universe and your body develop the more endorphin hormones of happiness and you have much more power and same you have much more muscles in your beautiful body this is everything and more oxygen in your blood and your brain work much more faster everything we needed to be in plan but please rate me the last question about digital detox do you need or you have control for social media. The fourth question, create a list of people with whom you keep in touch. For each of them, write down the answer to the following questions. What makes you happy about this report? Can I count on her support? Does it enrich my life or is it pulling me down do i meet her out of habits or out of my own will mark which people give you the more energy and make you feel positive about life and which are take the energy from you make an appointment with the people who, according to your list, support you and offer you an energy boost. Also, think about yourself. Maybe you are a friend to others. Talk to you to Dan once it's. Have you become such a toxic companion for one of your friends? Maybe you are just toxic person. Please take Think about this now. Maybe you need to change your life and be much more positive and don't call to nobody and travel from your story. Now is the time to write answer and think about this. If so, think about how you can change it. Honest conversation is always a good idea. But I repeat, be honest with yourself. Next very important question and lesson to you today is bring a new order to a new beginning by following the tips above at a month's time to clean the entire house into your plan. What we talking before? Take breaks between cleaning days to help keep you energized and I won't avoid feeling and uh, if you're doing this your house have a lot more energy give to every staff what you don't like to your friends family and donate to somebody who will be enjoy make a list of things that you don't need but have a hard time throwing away Sometimes we like many products and we don't want to throw to the garbage. Look for people who can make your stuff happy. Ask first of all your friends and family. You can also ask or help selling them over the internet. For example, you can return access books to the library or antique shop or the school. The second question from the mark today, it's about your inner critic. How many times we criticize ourselves? Many, many times. And today, now, I want just give you simple exercise, next mental exercise, how to work with the inner critic. Because if you know how to work with inner critic, you have much more positive energy about yourself. What is the first step to clean yourself 
and be happy inside you. The first exercise will be awareness is the first step to organizing and re realizing your inner critic. Identify the situation that may have caused an inner critic to surface. Replace overly critical thoughts with more specific statements. Change your pessimistic thoughts more rational and realistic ones. For example, if you think, then I never get it right. I got the steps wrong. When you do so, another thought will come. What can I do to dance well if you don't dance well? Don't criticize yourself. Just you always think positive. How can I change my life? How can I learn to dance? I don't cook it so well, but I try to do it my the best. And I never criticize myself because I doing many stuff in my life. I go to the school dance flamenco, I write many books, I doing lecture for people, I learn I have three degrees, I learn many languages, I learn history, literature, and um, I doing many jobs in my life. And because I don't learn cook, I don't want to beat myself, I just explain to people, then I don't cook so well. And I don't beat myself. It's impossible to be perfection with every topic. And this cooking, I try to eat healthy. I cook every day healthy stuff. But I never ever want to be perfection and make the beautiful cake. Maybe one day I try, but now it's impossible. First of all, I don't have time to do it, and this is not my pleasure, hobby, my passion, and uh, I am okay with this. And if you don't know how to dance, if you don't know how to speak more languages, don't beat yourself, just try to do your the best, and maybe you decide go for a special lesson which is amazing for your body, it's amazing to improve your brain, start to doing something more. If you accept yourself on every level where you are, you feel much comfortably and you have much more energy because today the topic is always about energy. And if you stop criticize yourself, inner critic, you feel much better, you feel free. You feel free. How many times many parents explain the children, you are not enough and criticize the poor children. Oh, you don't care about your uh, education, you're not doing this. It never is the best. If you have children, try to choose some nice, I don't know, topic, what he like, it's like mathematica, maybe uh, English language, maybe literature, maybe geography, history, and maybe just go to special musician school. Try to tell the child, then you are so proud of him. You teach him to feel the good energy in the life and teach him and show him the be proud of the second person, second human, once he's your child, it's very important to develop his position to be smart and strong when he go work. But how can we develop stronger children than we are not strong, than we beat ourselves, than we criticize? It's impossible. And uh, we always, if we want to change the world, we need to change ourselves. If we want to clean the world, first of all, we start clean the house. What's mean? If you want to change your child, show him, show him how to be the best person, mother, woman, the best person in the world. And show him that you are perfection. Every time a negative thought appears in your head, try to change it do realistic description of the situation. 
and if possible, look for positive stand statements. Going back to our exam or a rounder's dance steps, you can create some positive thoughts from a simple mistake that is typical for all beginner. I made a mistake. I remember that in the last class, I also needed time to properly dance the new choreography. Now I dance it fluffishly, so I will definitely be able to do some with the steps. I still have of many things to learn. I can wait to master this choreography. If you change this simple word and you just uh, try to think positively about yourself, about your pure energy, and you dedicate your life to develop the pure energy, and we just you just clean all negative energy what you have in your beautiful life you your purest heart your purest mind always will be much more healthy will be much more safe for your future because you will be like angel person and the energy it's everything if you want more read about the inner critic or more topics i propose you to my uh, book your quiet workbook your quiet to positive life power of calmness after the age of 50 the book is in my website active50tv.com uh, and also in the amazon shop and in the barnes and noble the next book was is all about don't lose your energy is the your guide to positive life don't lose your energy it's possible to buy the book yes this is the book this is the workbook and welcome to the book and the topics is it's more i just remind myself and you it's the morning routine oh the routine is very important too if you have every day the same routine and you remember everything what you're doing uh, you just have more time because if you're planning your time from the morning to the evening and of course your sleep is in your list to planning then you have good sleeping and time to sleep this is very important and you have the best energy ever you are not tired because you you are planning the time energy and stress of course we're talking just about this then the stress kill your positive energy what's mean we need to work with the stress and step by step planning your motivation acceptance and um, sleep and rest assertiveness you'll be assertive you learn how to tell people no i don't doing this i don't like cook and i don't cook sorry i don't doing this because i don't want to lose all day to cook one cake but in this time 12 hours when i cook probably one cake i have possibility to write many chapters of my book or doing something what i really like and i enjoy healthy eating and exercising healthy food give you much more power too maybe next time we're talking a little bit about food next week how give you the power and energy because the one reason is the sun when you have vitamin d your food and your internal feeling and you need to clean your mind clean your body everything is it's very important it's not just then we go for exercise and we have more energy when we come back home and we have that life we need to clean the energy in home we need to clean us self energy anger and jealousy the jealousy always is bad because if we jealous the neighbors then have be better house or car or the grass is much more green the sentence from poland we just feel very negative inside never be jealousy just doing more 
to improve yourself, to learn more, to be much more powerful person, much more smart and educated person. And this is your job. Toxic people, we just tell, and self-care. Self-care is always important because nobody loves you more than you love yourself. And you remember this is the very, very important. If you, woman, accept yourself, your beautiful spirit, your body, you are the best person ever. And next you have possibility, and you give love to people. You have possibility to develop the very happy family. You give to your children pure love and you develop the beautiful energy in your house. You imagine when you just don't care yourself and you always is unhappy, jealous, angry, this don't make sense. And next you want happiness from somebody else? Your husband don't give you happiness if you are not happy inside. The first step is to work with yourself and we organize from in the June, I tell you next time when and where, we organize this special workshop. And uh, if you decide, it will be a pleasure to meet with you. The workshop will be for only 20 women who want to change their life, who want to work and have many questions and just needed the answer. And little bit change your life, change the life, your family. And you remember, happy woman, happy life. It's like we always talking the happy wife, happy life, happy life, happy wife. And this makes sense. And thank you so much for today. The Power of Life for Women, Kate Doros. Please enjoy my website, active50tv.com or go to Barnes and & Noble or go to Amazon and see my lovely workbooks. Everything what's changed your life and work with your energy. I wish you the best day today. Seniors can oftentimes have feelings of loneliness, loss, and sadness. Now is the time to motivate your mind and body. World-renowned author and motivator, Katrazina DeRose, can help mature adults renew their lives. With her selection of self-help books now available on Amazon, seniors can learn how to feel happy again, more independent, and enjoy what life has to offer. Older children can learn how to help their parents, improve their life habits, and be happy again. For more information, visit our website, purchase our books on Amazon, and learn to be positive for the rest of your life.